My name is Pierre Conradi. I'm the owner of this yellow Studebaker Bucky. Uh, it's been used on most of the printing material for the 2020 George Alcar show, which is on the 8th, the Saturday, and the 9th, the Sunday of February. Uh, I purchased the car uh, quite some time ago from a person in Johannesburg who was selling glass. Uh, I luckily stopped the guy because he was about to make a hot out of it. Uh, it was in fairly bad condition and it took me about three years to, to restore. Uh, I did it a ground up restoration and I ordered most of the parts from America which is called new old stock or NOS uh, parts. Um, I did a few things to make it more convenient. Uh, but still keeping the car very much original. Uh, I changed the gearbox with a car gearbox uh, with an overdrive that was available in America but not in South Africa. I changed the diff ratio, I made it a lower ratio to again drive easier and I changed the front uh, brakes to a disc brake conversion. So, and the engine is still standard, it's a 259 cubic inch. Uh, it's the equivalent of about four and a half uh, Coke bottles, litre Coke bottles. Um, it's quite a strong engine and with the change that I made to the drivetrain it's 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 very fast uh, the car has, is unique it's it's very few on the road uh, as you can see it's got the uh, bumpers I call it the step side which stands out uh, my uh, nickname for it is uh, Doug Bowder because of the um, bumpers uh, standing out and it's it's the only bucky with the spare wheel built into the bumper um, this car was quite famous. It was uh, used by a person like El Debo. Uh, it was used as a police bucky and the car was really built with a shoestring budget. They used the front of the 59 Studebaker lock and married it to the older version uh, bucky at uh, the, uh, the back the side and later they used the Dodge which was a fleet side which is a smooth side. So this one is unique with this uh, uh, combination. I, I really love driving the car. It's done quite a number of tours and it's it's just going faultless and it draws a lot of attention mainly because it's yellow and people often come to me and they ask questions like how fast can it go and how strong is it and can they look at the engine and what is the acceleration like and they, they love the noise. Uh, driving it, it is really relieving stress because it, you sit very comfortably in it and when you turn the window down and you just drive uh, you can hear that V8 motor uh, purring, which is very nice and very calming. So I really enjoy driving the car. It's my favorite car. I've got a number of Studebakers, but this is the one I love driving.